and also a British-born man who was a member of the team, or rather a team of Islamic State militants in Syria, nicknamed the Beatles, has pleaded guilty to terrorism charges. Alexander Cote tried on eight U.S. criminal charges, including beheading four American hostages, lethal hostage taking, and conspiracy to support terrorists. He is one of two Islamic State members held in uh, Iraq by the U.S. military before being flown to the United States to face trial. Acting U.S. Attorney for the Eastern District of Virginia, Raj Parekh, uh, says Cote has been offered uh, due process. Perpetuated by ISIS, we have given Alexander Cote the opportunity to face justice. Cote has been afforded due process and, in the face of overwhelming evidence, he made the independent decision to plead guilty to his crimes. The justice, fairness, and humanity that this defendant received in the United States stand in stark contrast to the cruelty, inhumanity, and indiscriminate violence touted by the terrorist organization that he espoused. As the mother of James Wright Foley, I call on President Biden, our U.S. Congress, and all Americans to demand that our country protect and assist any innocent U.S. national held hostage or wrongfully detained abroad. Our U.S. citizenship should mean that our country will do their very best to shrewdly negotiate for, rescue, and recover our U.S. nationals whenever they are in danger abroad. Thank you. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.